Right, hi there, welcome to a Friday video. I'm just coming back from shopping. And uh, yeah, let's, let's get caught up, shall we? Um, so, uh, I made a video on Wednesday talking about the comics industry in a post COVID 19 world. And uh, it's looking like a lot of it might come true. Uh, some company called Comic Cup have announced some kind of placeholder solution, uh, which kind of is a bit wishful thinking and slightly woolly, woolly thinking. Um, so essentially, what happens is there seems to be an elaborate sort of a set of apps that link you to your LCS, which then allows you to buy a digital strop, digital comics with a redemption code that your LCS will then allow you to then pick up a physical copy when they start printing again. I mean, this is making the massive assumption that Diamond are actually still going to be any kind of meaningful company at the end of all this. And I don't think that's going to happen. So, I think the industry is still facing some bleak times. And I think the solutions still have to be, let's be tough, let's be lean, and let's do things like offer returns on books. Simple stuff, really. Uh, enough about that, though. So, um, I've done some comics this week. Uh, so let's talk about this week's comics, shall we? Um, so the first up is this page. This is a one-page comic written by Philip Boothorn. Um, I've done a few scripts of his before. Um, this one has dinosaurs in it, so that's always good for a laugh. Um, and yeah, that, that, that was quite fun. I was playing with a new idea, with a new, new couple of new ideas in, in terms of colouring the, the story. Which actually I quite like, so I might, might be adopting some, some of those ideas. Uh, next up is this it's a one page mini comic which will be published on my Twitter feed later on today. Now, by the time this is by the time this video has gone live, it will be published, so it's not really a scoop. Uh, I'll be doing one of these every week, every Friday, I'll do one until such a point as this situation in terms of uh, you know, isolation and stuff blows over or I run out of things to make comics about so I'll keep on with that okay next up uh, this is the four pages um, of a new project I'm working on which is based on Midsummer Night's Dream uh, now I've got a four page story that I'm already finishing up uh, so I want to push these two four page stories out the door pretty sharpish uh, I want to sort of get um, the one story is, is inked, it just needs colouring and typing, typesetting. Uh, so I need, to, I want to get that out of the way by the next week. And this one I want to get pencils down by this time next week. And the inks down. Uh, so by end of April, both those stories will be done. Uh, their deadlines, I believe, in June. Um, so yeah, this is a very exciting. Um, I think the last, the first. I don't know, a week or so of, of the uh, of the of the social isolation it was it was tricky because we we forget how much we interact with people even if we say that we're we're, sh we're shut-ins we don't go out or we don't like talking to people actually you find that you you end up interacting with people and you end up relying on people to do things you know you rely on the shops to be open you rely on you know. Um, co-workers being in the building or you rely on them being able to do stuff and uh, when you can't do that and when, you, when you're when you're working from home and your work from home relies on a uh, sustainable and stable internet connection uh, that can be a little bit fraught uh, especially when it goes belly up uh, <laughs> but I think I'm starting to get some kind of routine down, which means I'm starting to increase my productivity in comics, which is a good thing. Uh, that's a good thing. I want, I want to get that productivity up for that. So uh, yeah, uh, I've I've talked long enough about this. Um, I'm hoping I'm going to sign off now. But I wish you all a happy weekend, a great weekend. Stay safe. Obviously, everyone's saying I want to stay safe. You know, wash hands. Uh, don't touch your face. Uh, um, isolate, so, you know, so, uh, keep going out at the minimum. Oh, second time I've been out this week is to get this shopping 
first time to shopping. Uh, I'm the shopping person, so yeah. Uh, and uh, yeah, just look after yourself and try and look after everybody else. Try and keep everyone safe. And uh, have a, try and have a good weekend. Um, and I will speak to you all next week. All right, take care. Thanks for watching. Hit the subscribe button. Make sure you're still subscribed and lock the bell for notifications. Okay, bye bye now.